Hello everyone, I'm going to show you how to store and solve equations using your HP 50G calculator. So first things first, you need to follow the link in the description and download the files there. And you have to acquire an SD card and copy the pequm.hp file on an SD card and insert that SD card into your HP calculator while it is switched off. And I've, I've already done that, so let's get started putting it on so what you need to do is you need to copy the .hp file into your flash of your calculator so what you do is left arrow apps button to go into files go into SD and you scroll until you get the pequm.hp file and you say copy and you scroll again to your flash drive and you say ok and that's about it now you have copy the program into your calculator. Now to access the program you need to press the right key and number 7 numsolve and you see the PEQUM option is listed there. So you can go into that you see no entry. So to start writing equations you have to go new equation into its name let's say force for example and then you ask you to write the equation so let's say f equals n times a say so enter and then the force equation is stored now to access the equation you see there's the option to solve it displays the equation you just press enter then you're there so then you can just enter values for mass for example and acceleration and then you just scroll to the F and say solve and there it's solved. So you can put it in values for every variable and just go to the variable you want solved and press solve. You can also press info if you want to see the whole solved answer. So that's basically it to creating and solving an equation. Now this program also allows you to store equations in folders for example if you need to store equations for different subjects or something similar or you just want to keep your equations sorted you can press next and you see there's create di directory so when you do that it says ask for a name just say for example water and we access that still no so you need to Add equation, just a new equation. Let's name this one Discharge and write it Right, so I've written the equation, just press enter again. Then this chart is created, I want to solve it. You can just press a value for the discharge and a value for the velocity and solve the diameter of the pipe, for example. Okay, so that's very convenient. And I'm just going to do another one. So new equation, name it pressure. And you say pressure P equals now you want to use the row symbol and the HP calculator has comes with a pre-installed list of characters that you can use so you just play, press the right arrow and say charge and you see there's a whole list of symbols you can use I want to use the row symbol times G which is 9.81 times H. So enter again and then my pressure equation has been created. Also if you want to order equations you can always just scroll to order and it if you press order on equation it puts the selected equation at the top of the list of equations. So let's for example do that and there we go. Another thing I must show you is if you go on you see the note option. So if you see you can press it and write 
something for example rho equals rho equals density you ask you the save node you say yes this is very handy if you want to make quick notes define variables also you can view the note or edit it you saw the edit option there whatever you want to do also you can edit equations if you're not satisfied for example I want to edit that I want to put in small g for some reason and there you see it's edited also you can delete equations and move them around in directories just as you wish also rename them if you wish to do so and that's more or less all you need to know to get started thank you very much for watching i hope you enjoyed the video and enjoy using your hp calculator